Good morning and happy Vlogmas Day 10. It is afternoon actually, not even morning. We had, well I had a slow start to the day and then when I came downstairs to film um, I realized hubby was still doing laundry um, and the dryer was making a ruckus. I'm like okay I can't film. So I just chilled and um, I did do a little bit of sewing this morning but not a whole lot and I will share um, the progress I made this morning. But anywho, I do have also a couple errands I need to run this afternoon. It's pouring rain out there. It is very mild, hence the t-shirt today. I'm having a bit of a hot episode. My hair is still wet from the shower. I can't be bothered to dry it. And I have no makeup on because I figured I'd give my face a little bit of a break. Seeing as it's Sunday and I'm not really going anywhere. So, yes. <laughs> A little bit of rambling for you this morning. Let's get the prim calendar open. Now the Beyond the Pink Door was a virtual gift this morning and it was a tutorial from Andrea on how to make scrunchies and infinity scarves using the burrito method which is really really cool. I think I'm gonna have to try that. My daughter Marianne loves scrunchies so I might look into my scraps and see if I can make a few of those for her. Anywho, Ugh. there we go. Let's look for number 10. And there it is. Ooh, measuring tape. Oh, and it snaps, look. It has a snap, how cool is that? Oh, very nice, very nice. I had to give Marianne one of these because I make a lot of clothes for her and I make some for her partner. So I gave her one of these to keep at her house so that if I need measurements, you know, she's got this. So that left me with just one and now I have another one, which is amazing. So um, today is going to be more bag making. I'm really crossing my fingers that my rivet setting tool is going to get here soon because I am done with the exterior of three of the bags. So now is when I need to put the rivets in. Although, you know, I could work on the lining and stuff, so it's not a big deal as long as they get here today. And then um, I was thinking maybe I could do a closet clear out, but I don't think I will. I'm really not in the mood. So I'm going to keep working on my bags. Yeah. And um, yeah, share my progress with all of you. I think it's going to be a short one today, but you never know. So yeah, I'll leave it here for now and I'll check in with you later. Hey, there we go. Here is the exterior of three of the bags. Um, all that's left to do on the exterior is just to put the rivets on the straps here. So we've got the front pockets here and a fun lining. I put the handmade sign or decoration on there. I even put purse feet. And so we've got two gray ones. We've got a butterfly one. Um, I am loving how these are turning out and yeah I'm almost tempted to forget about lining for now and just keep going with the exterior of the other bags although I probably should not do this because I need to match the thread for the top stitching at the top and I really don't want to have to switch threads 50 million times. So maybe I'll just keep going with the linings for these and hopefully my rivet setting tool is going to get here soon. Uh, decisions, decisions, and I'm really not in the mood <laughs> to be making decisions today. <laughs> Anywho, I'll just, I'll keep going with the lining, I think, and just keep it simple. All right, I'll check in in a bit. So I think many of you don't even know I have a second cat. This is Puffs. Puffs is 
11 years old. He's very grumpy. He hates bear with a passion. And he is always hiding in this corner of our dining room, AKA my office. And he basically just sleeps in his bed all day. <laughs> but he's such a good cat. He's just a really, really good cat. So I thought I'd introduce him. Hello. So it is much later in the day. It's after six o'clock. Um, I'm upstairs now because I thought maybe I'd have dinner, but you know what? I'm not feeling great. I've had a really bad headache all afternoon. And yeah, um, I don't know. I don't know. So I'm skipping dinner. Dougie had a salad. So I'm now cleaning the kitchen and I'm just taking a very short break having a decaf coffee. Um, yeah, and this afternoon sewing was not hugely successful. I mean, I did make progress on the bags, but I made a ton of mistakes, had to unpick things. I, yeah, it just wasn't a great afternoon of sewing. I just couldn't focus and yeah. So I'm upstairs now. I'm gonna go sit down with my husband for a while. The Montreal Canadiens are playing tonight, so I'm gonna watch that with him, at least a couple periods with him. And then he's probably gonna end up going to bed and I'll just go back downstairs and try to see if I can focus a little bit better and make more progress. So I will come back in a little while and um, yeah, we'll see how what I get up to. Talk to you in a bit. Hello, me again. So it is, uh, it is past nine o'clock. I did some really good progress on the lining. So my zippers or my recessed zippers are installed. Had a few issues with those, but worked through them. And my rivet setting tool never got here. I am very disappointed with Mr. Amazon. Hopefully it's gonna be here tomorrow because I am determined to finish at least three of those bags by the time I go to bed tomorrow night. So it might still be all about bags for you guys tomorrow night or tomorrow. Um. So yeah, so I'm gonna leave it here. I am more than a little tired. I'm gonna edit this, upload it to YouTube so it's ready for you in the morning. I'll finish watching the hockey game and then I'm going to bed <laughs> because it is a work day tomorrow. So I hope you've enjoyed today. Um, I hope you have a great night and I will see you tomorrow for day 11 of Vlogmas. Bye.